Hey everybody, AmpRepairGuy.com, 203-892-4119. So we have another Heathkit SB220. It's pretty clean inside. Fan is seized. I'm going to go ahead and do everything I normally do. Putting a new metering board in from Harbach Electronics, new filter cap board, plate blocker, just everything you normally see me do. I started on soldering the connections from the grid for, for each tube. I took the choke out on this side, I started soldering that side, so uh, took out the caps. I took out the soft start. One of the resistors was damaged on the board here, so I, I don't put these in, they're not needed. You know, the transformers are wound to limit the amount of inrush, so they're just not needed. Already has the soft key installed. And change electrolytic and uh, do everything else I normally do. So I'll be back. See you guys soon. Stay tuned. All right, so I'm back with the completed amplifier, the Heathkit SB220, Harbach metering board, Harbach filter cap board assembly, new plate blocking cap. The air variables are in good condition. Band switch, good condition. Clean the input rotary switch and the output rotary slash band switch with deoxy gold. Got a brand new fan. Customer had ordered that from Harbach a long while back when he still had them available. Rewound new parasitic suppressor resistors. Soldered it up really well. New meter lamp bulbs. Got the series glitch resistor in there. And I'll uh, flip it over and show you the bottom. Be right back. See you soon. Hey, so I grounded the grids really well. Already had the soft key touched up on the solder joints. I had the soft start with the damaged resistor. That's why I don't install them. Because if you ever have a short upon startup, it just takes out the resistor. And then the customer has to take it all apart. A lot of times they'll end up having to send it back to me. And like I said, the transformers are wound to limit the inrush. So resoldered the wires over here that were connected to the soft start put a new electrolytic cap in clean the TR slash bias relay deoxy gold touched up on some other solder joints I always solder and heat shrink the wires for the fan I don't use those wire nut things so zip tied everything so this thing is good to go if you need an amplifier repaired please feel free to give me a call. Also check the SO239s. They're tight. They're stock, but they're tight. So, thanks for watching. Phone number is 203-892-4119. That's 203-892-4119. And the website is amprepairguy.com. 73.